What's up guys, it's Chachi Power here with another Rocket Punch Army video. This is the final uh, episode of my whole light tan thing. I wanted to review all the light tan Chogokin I have. Uh, the reissues at least. And uh, yeah, so this is the final one. This is Mechanic Light Tan GB42, which was originally released by Popey, then reissued by Bandai in 2007. Uh, what's cool about these is that they're all very weird and quirky and just really silly but they are loaded with die cast and that's the important thing guys loaded with die cast which makes them even cooler and in case you uh, go insane and start throwing stuff you can probably kill somebody if you wanted to but um I don't recommend that we're just gonna look at the box here very plain aside from this little colorful piece here which I will show you guys in a second that's actually a replica of the vintage box so let's go ahead let's stop blabbing and open this guy up Alright, it's more of the same styrofoam tray, although I never get bored of that. Alrighty, let's put the box off to the side here, and check this out. Okay, so styrofoam tray just like the other ones. You got the replica box uh, right on the side here. We'll start off with this one first. The other videos I started off with the robot first, but uh, yeah, so here's the vintage style box. It's got uh, the mechanic light tan on the side here, and on the front. Uh, so apparently it's a mechanic that turns into a box. Pop off this little piece here and there he is in his gold glory. Once again nestled into this sexy velvety bed. And he's got some missiles right up here which he can shoot. Got some gold missiles and red missiles. Alright. So let's pop him out of this very unsexy scotch tape package. So apparently uh, mechanic light tan uh, is a gold pimpy mailbox. No, actually I don't know what he is. If I find out, I'll put it right below here somewhere. If not, there'll be nothing here. Uh, Alright, so I spoiled the surprise. There's his face. Alright, there's the head. Nice and blue. This is actually the most colorful light tan I have. Uh, aside from all the gold, this one actually has a robotic metallic blue. And a pretty crazy head sculpt. Uh, yeah. So, uh, I guess we can continue with transformation. Uh, there's really nothing much to see out here except uh, shiny gold and a little foil sticker there with the copyright information and fingerprints. Yeah, so uh, this one looks like it might be a little harder to transform. I don't know where to start. Maybe down here. All right, this thing moves. Get that. All right, got little wheels on there. Look at that. All right, next, uh, I guess, uh, stick my nail in here. Ooh, more wheels. Look at that. Wow. Yeah, what's cool is, like, you don't even need instructions. You just wing it, you know what I mean? And uh, after that, I think these things open. Let's see. Oh, look at that. I knew. I knew somehow this little red thing on top was a button for something. There you go. Let's try that again. I actually find that pretty neat. Oh, look at that. Oh, who said weird robots aren't cool? And then we bring, uh, oop, heard something there. Let's see. Ooh, look at that. Oh, there you go. Shooting gimmicks. Look at that, guys. This thing is crazy looking. I don't even know what to say about this thing. Uh, so let's get the little baggie, which is full of missiles and gold crap. What I originally thought was gold and red missiles. Turns out I was wrong. There's actually six plastic missiles, all right, which you see here. And the other ones, the gold ones, are actual tools. They're not even missiles. And they are die cast, believe it or not, guys. These little things are die cast. So, because he has a toolbox, he does have tools. So, this is the Phillips head on the left. You get the flathead screwdriver. You get a drill. And you get a socket. Now, because he does store them in him, uh, you do have to bring this little piece down like so. And just insert every piece of tool in there once you have that done you can just bring it back up and it stores nicely in his chest right there and then the missiles are just pretty much self-explanatory you just grab one for each here just pop it in this comes out look at that chrome little arms this comes out like so let's see this effer shoot let's shoot there Oops. let's support him a bit that was cool. Let's try the other one. Nice. Yeah, so I'm actually very impressed with this. This thing looks like jewelry. Look at this thing. 
And he's a mechanic, so like if something on your house breaks, this guy just shows up to your house. I'm here to fix your toilet. And normally I would do the little glowing thing where you guys can see all the die casts. It's really not necessary with these light tan figures. If it's gold, it's die cast. Or steel, like the wheels. And uh, that's it, guys. That's completely it. This is the last of my gold light tan review. I hope you enjoyed it. This thing is sick. I'm going to go stick it down my pants. Until next time, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>